Diocese of Guadalupe Media. Today is November 3rd. Our daily meditation is taken from one bread, one body. What's there for, there for? One of the scribes came up, and when he heard them arguing, he realized how skillfully Jesus answered them. He decided to ask him, which is the first of all the commandments? Jesus replied, this is the first. This reading is taken from Mark 12, 28 and 29. The first of all the commandments is, Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God is Lord alone. Since he is Lord, therefore, you shall love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul, with all your mind, and with all your strength. The word therefore shows that the giving of our all is based on the acceptance of God as Lord alone. We repeatedly call people to give their all in work, finances, etc. But when we try this in evangelization, the response to our pleas is usually apathetic. So we then try to adapt Christianity by making it a half-hearted activity rather than a total commitment. Rather, we should discern the reason for the refusal to give all is that God is not accepted as Lord alone. Unless we obey the first commandment, we are not fully obeying the others. Commitment to Christ's body must be preceded by commitment to the Lord, the head of the body, which is the church. Until Jesus is Lord of all, he is not Lord at all, and Christian life is not even possible. You are right in saying, he is the one, there is no other than he. First things first. Prayer, Jesus, I repent of my sins. I ask you to come into my heart. I accept you as my Lord and Savior. Take over my life. Promise. Therefore, he is always able to save those who approach God through him, since he forever lives to make intercession for them. Praise. All praise be to you, glorious risen Lord Jesus Christ. You reign supreme over all creation. I worship you, magnificent in glory. Thank you for listening. Join us tomorrow for another daily meditation. Have a blessed day.